Hey, Jarek here, and this is called the Folding Hand Cannon. And yeah, that's pretty true to its name. It's built like an absolute tank. It's entirely metal. It folds and unfolds, and for its size, it shoots pretty good. When I chronoed this thing, it was getting about 100 FPS with Worker Gen 3 darts. When I chronoed with Bamboo darts, it was getting about 110 FPS. I was not kidding when I said this thing is nothing but just solid metal. Like, very solid metal. And it's also small enough to fit in your pocket. This could be a last-ditch resort. You just whip it out, open it, and fire. The only downside to that, and you might have noticed this while I was chronoing, is that this being primed will not stay primed if you close it, because the trigger is part of the closing mechanism right there, which is as small as you can get it, but if you fold it shut, you'll press the trigger. Still, this is almost as small as you're going to get for a blaster of this power. Now, don't get me wrong, this isn't the strongest blaster you're ever going to find, but for its size, that's pretty darn good. And again, I, I just have to reiterate this, this thing is built like a tank. It's hard to get that to come through on camera, but I think just looking at it, you can get the idea. Look how solid, like that's just a big chunk of metal. The locking mechanism is also pretty darn solid as well. Loading it is as you would expect, press that, Put in a dart, cock it, and there you go. Since it's a breech loader, you can load in anything you want. Full length darts do indeed work in this, just barely fit, but they do function. I forgot to chrono the full length darts, and to be honest, I don't want to break my chrono back out just to chrono full length darts. Who really cares? No one's going to be using them. What you probably do care about though is that, yes, you can indeed double load them. Here's two bamboo darts. Fires them just fine. You can also, if you want to, fire these 50 cal sized foam balls. Just stick one in and it works like anything else. Is my mouth blue? Oh, I should not have been eating sour candy before I recorded this. Okay, whatever, we press on. Oh yeah, you can fire 50 cal foam balls out of this, which means you can also shotgun 50 cal foam balls out of this. You have a folding pocket shotgun, basically. That's really fun. This even has some surprisingly okay sights out of what this is. You wouldn't expect that, but I mean, yeah, you can use them pretty effectively. The one thing I would tell you to be cautious of is that the grip is just too small for my hand. Okay, quite a bit too small for my hand. Too short, more specifically. Which means when I prime this, if I'm not careful where my hand is, this will smack into my hand. Which doesn't really hurt, but that will make the shot weaker. Like that. So when you're shooting this, kind of like choke up on it. Just try to get your hand out of the way. But yeah, I'm quite impressed with this thing. Really solid construction quality out of this. Folds up, super small, will fit in basically any pocket. So this could either be just a fun toy that you want to mess around with in your house or give to a kid, or it could be a backup for your backup in your back pocket. I mean, this is the size of most wallets. A little thicker, but yeah, pretty small. It is also fairly accurate. You're going to just kind of have to take my word there. I'm filming in my studio and do not have much space, but I will shoot it a little bit for you. First up is a full length Adventure Force waffle head dart. Half length worker gen three. Two different bamboo darts. Fifty cal foam ball. And to finish it out, let's just see how many of these we can fit in here. It's five. Looks like we got room for one more. It probably won't shoot great with six in here, but yeah, you gotta try it. All right, six 50 cal foam balls in here. Let's just go ahead and see. It worked. It wasn't strong enough to knock over the target, but you know, let's see if we can find an optimal amount. I'm gonna put three in here. About half of what I just did before. Eh, 
Yeah, that worked a good amount better. So yeah, this thing is really cool. Simple folding design, very, very solid metal. Would highly recommend. It was sent to me from CS Noobs. I'll have a link down below in the video information if you want to get one of these things for yourself. I quite like it.